Hey everyone, Brad here. Welcome to Airstream Utah. On this Walkthrough Wednesday, I'm going to give you a tour of this 2023 27FB International with a bunk. Join me. As always, I'm going to give you a bit of the specs on this model before we get started on the tour. So here we go. This 27FB is actually 28 feet long, and that's from the rear bumper to the front hitch. It's 8 feet 5 and a half inches wide on the outside. It's 8 feet 1 inches wide on the inside. It's 9 feet 9 inches tall on the outside and 6 feet 7 and a half inches tall on the inside. It has a hitch weight of 850 pounds. It has a dry weight of 6,100 pounds and a gross vehicle weight rating of 7,600 pounds. Therefore, you have a cargo carrying capacity of 1,500 pounds. 37, 35, and 40 fresh gray black tank size. It has a 15,000 BTU ducted air conditioner with a heat pump right here above my head. And up in the front, this one came with the second optional 13,500 BTU air conditioner with a heat pump. Therefore, it's a 50 amp service. It has a 25,000 BTU ducted furnace down below, propane gas furnace. It has an eight cubic foot, 12 volt all electric refrigerator. You have a beautiful, uh, very light emitting 18 windows and skylights in here. This particular model comes with a queen bed, which is 60 inches by 75 inches wide. The dinette back here converts to a bed size of 42 by 97 inches. And you can sleep up to seven in this model because it has the bunk up front, the optional bunk. Let's go check it out. Standing up here in the front of the Airstream, I have this nice, beautiful queen size bed with a nightstand table on both sides. I have this nice giant wraparound window here. And you can see up above, I have the bunk bed option, which is pretty rare in a queen bed, but it is an option. This space is limited to 200 pounds and it's kind of small, but it's perfect for us for a young young kid. You have storage underneath the bed. Over here on this wall you have blank space for you to decorate as you see fit and over there on that wall is a TV and all your air conditioning controls. Standard up here in the bedroom right down here below on both sides of the bed you have a power outlet and USB plugs to charge your devices at night. Walking out of your bedroom you have your shower on this side, lavatory on this side, and this has a wonderful beautiful medicine cabinet up top, plenty of counter space, plenty of storage space, and generally just plenty of space to stand in here. You can see I have the bathroom door open. It will open up all the way. There is a curtain that will close here and a curtain that closes back there behind this door. And you could have this space open and used as a, a third room, so to speak, when you close both curtains because you can still access your hall closet, your shower and your bathroom all in an enclosed space. The shower here is pretty standard shower for any size model. The only thing that really changes if you have a hall shower meaning somewhere in the middle, not on the ends, is the bench size. So the bench will either go all the way across or to have a little notch cut out because of the wheel well. But the basic dimensions of most hall showers are about the same. Next here's your hall closet. And this 27 FB, you have two doors. And it's a very large closet space in here for plenty of hanging and plenty of storage up top. Moving out of the bathroom area into the kitchen area, I have a very large pantry space up here and a giant pull-out drawer. If you get this model with the microwave left in it and the gas oven, there will be a microwave here and a separate drawer, but you still have from here down this pantry space. This particular model was ordered with a convection oven microwave, so it deleted the regular microwave, giving you more pantry space here. Moving into our kitchen, I have a three burner cooktop here with a range vent hood up above. Again, this model has the convection oven microwave and plenty of storage and drawer space here and counter space to prepare meals. Directly across from your cooking space is your refrigerator. This eight cubic foot refrigerator freezer is a very wonderful, uh, very deep refrigerator. Great size for this model. Up here in the remainder of your kitchen, you have your two nice windows here, Moen faucet that swivels, and retracts. You have your sink cover here which covers up this very nice spacious deep sink and then down below you have your storage space and over on this side is your trash can. Here on the long couch side you this pulls out to become a bed should you need to. This pulls all the way out these back cushions become the bed. And you have storage space with storage bins down below. Up here underneath the table you have a pull down on storage space here and up under this side 
is a pull-out drawer for storage underneath this bench. This table quickly pops down to make this whole space of bed back here. And I'm going to show you what the whole bed space looks like made now. So now I have the entire bed space made and it's very, very spacious. For example, back here on the main part, I've got plenty of room back here and plenty of space. And even on the side part, I have plenty of space here too. So I could lay two people here fairly comfortable. Now let's put it all back together. And just like that, we're back to normal. Back here in your rear cabinet, you have your HDMI plug, your inverter outlet, a USB charging port, and your radios back here. If you're not aware, the 2023 models come with a 12 volt TV, so it's hooked directly to your battery. So no longer do you have to turn your inverter on to watch TV. The International comes automatically with an awning package, so you have awning on three sides, and on that side, on your porch side or your curb side, you have a very large awning. These awning colors are one of my favorite colors of all the awning packages. All of your controls, so your dump station, your water controls, your water inlet, your black tank flush, your outside shower, all that stuff is located on this side of the rig, which makes it convenient. You have your bumper back here for bumper storage. Should you have any questions about this model or anything else we have in our inventory, please give us a call, send us an email, check out our website, better yet, stop by. We'd love to help you out in person. Thanks for joining me today. Have a great day, everyone, and happy adventure. <music>